Good morning, Israel. Good morning, Shalom. Blessings, greetings, salutations to the believers in the Most High, the I Am, our Heavenly Father, His only begotten Son, Yeshua, Joshua, Jesus Christ, Jesus Christos, um, whatever language you speak or the name you prefer, Yahweh Shai in the Paleo Hebrew, the language of our forefathers Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob, and the Rekaha Kodash or the Ruach or the Holy Spirit, the Holy Ghost, the Spirit that comes down from on a high to and fill the men of the Lord with a love for the gospel, for the Heavenly Father, and especially for our Deliverer, our Savior, the only begotten Son, who came to us through the Holy Spirit. This is Word of Truth with J.D. Nyjah, Coffee with J.D. Nyjah. Good morning. Good morning, believers. Glad you're here. <clears throat> so, today I'm going to speak about <clears throat> Salakia, the same issue that's been come up over the, um, the head covering. Um, so, uh, <laughs> you know, the thing that <clears throat> is interesting about these Hebrew Israelites and GMS in particular, and man, I tried to watch some IUIC, um, they're Hebrew Israelites that go by, um, IUIC, how's it go? Um, Israelites united in Christ. Oh my God, you want to trip out on some crazy, I don't even know if you call it Bible teaching. It is, <laughs> wow. It's like, <clears throat> It's like hip hop, black exploitation movies, and um, rap with God all rolled into one. It's like these people should be embarrassed. They're see if you're using cult of personality, if you're trying to be somebody in this thing. You're going off. It's not about you, dummies. So what happened, um, the thing I always get on these GMS guys about is their thumbnails. They they do a lot of uh, brown nosing and, and butt kissing between each other. And, and this one channel, um, Fishers Turned Hunters. The guy, what they do is they get these uh, these cartoon characters, these graven images of these, I guess they're uh, future Hebrew Israelites of the kingdom flying through space and holding scepters and with their glowing robes on and their eyes. It's like total cartoon creation shit. So, uh, what they do is they'll take the voice of um, one of the apostles and they'll they'll put it to the background of this these um, Israelite superheroes flying through space in these cartoon characters. And all I did was say, um, "Cute." I just left a comment, "Cute," because it is. It's like so cute, so so beautifully kiss ass. 
and so beautifully graven images. And, um, geez, coming in hot. So, um, so he, he told me to get off his channel and this and that. And, um, they keep making a big deal of this symbolic deal with the, with the covering the head <clears throat> and to a certain extent it, it makes sense and I'm not going to say it doesn't because if that's going to stumble you if that's your biggest issue abiding by something Paul mentioned once it's only mentioned in the scriptures once and that lets you know that it was <clears throat> it was a later doctrine of Paul and this doctrine this this Pauline ordinance about covering the head it was actually um, in response to the Jewish <clears throat> um, coverings that the men used to wear in the temple they used to it was like a hoodie. They'd put this hoodie over their head. They didn't have hats. They didn't have ball caps. They didn't have, um, what do you call them? The ski caps. You know, the stuff that we wear now. So basically, <clears throat> they're <clears throat> picking at things that don't really matter. They Instead of listening to what I'm saying, and... Realizing that the graven images, see that they, they're good at pointing the finger, but they but if you point the finger at them, they don't, they they'll never respond. So he made a whole video about me. Yeah, he called it um, J D Nija the saltine. And I said I like that saltine, because I am the salt of the earth, right? And um. I guess he's trying to call me a cracker. Whatever. Negro. Yeah. Cracker. I'm a saltine. I'm the salt of the earth. But um, he brought up a scripture that correction is grievous to those who are going to be destroyed or blah, blah, blah. I'll read it to you. This is, this is what he named his... Uh, this is what he named his um, video. J.D. Nyjah, the Saltine, and he, he, this was the name of his, on his thumbnail, and boy, did I set him off, this dude, I got him so hot, he, he looked through some of my videos, and you know, what's funny is he, <laughs> the parts that I saw, I was just kind of watching some of it, I didn't really, I don't care what the hell he says, he can say, he can bring out any video and he can make fun of anything I say, but <clears throat> I stand by the things I say and, you know, whether this stumbles you or not, obviously people like the hat because I got a bunch of, um, th this hat got the most views I've ever got. So... When Paul says, I'll be all things to all men, he also said that too. I don't know what your name is. I don't know what you call yourself. Fisher turned hunter, dude. I never see your face. I see it once in a while. You never show your face. Because probably you don't want people to do to you what you did to me. And throw my face up there and go through it. He went through all my channels. Oh, this guy listens to GMS. Yeah, I do. I'm not denying that. So what? I listen to vocab. I listen to I listen to a lot of different scriptural stuff because I don't just hold on to one doctrine. I search out the the scriptures. I'm not a one one horse pony show. I'm trying to get to the truth. The truth isn't in fucking black Hebrew Israelism. That's for damn sure. Some fucking bugged out religion. That's like halfway there and halfway not. 
So this scripture he brought out, 1510. Correction is grievous. <laughs> Correction is grievous unto him that forsaken, forsaketh the way, and he that hateth reproof shall die. I don't hate reproof. On, off, on, off. Lord, can you... Am I dishonoring you? Am I dishonoring you, Lord? When I put my hat on? It's nonsense. The Lord is my shepherd. I shall not want. If I can get people to hear the word of the Lord because I have a hat on, so be it. There's one scripture that talks about a man covering his head. And it's in the context of... Um, Yahweh being the head of Christ, Christ being the head of man, and man being the head of woman. The symbolism is greater. That's what these ninnies don't understand. The symbolism is greater than the actual reality of hat on, hat off. Hat on, hat off. Hell and destruction are before the Lord. How much more than the hearts of the children of men? A scorner loveth not one that reproveth him, neither will he go unto the wise. I am not mad. I reproved him, and he got furious. Do I look mad? <clears throat> he, he, he was upset. <laughs> so that's that. I'm not going to go too much into it. Um. The fact of the matter is, is that um, these different Hebrew is Israelite groups, they're so scared of their, their selves because they know that they're angry. They know that they're um, militant. They know they're racist. They know there they're are a lot of things that aren't right. And that's the point that they don't get. They're they're missing the forest for the trees. It's like, have some humility. Um, verse 18 of same, same page. I just, I'm just going to read the book. We'll go over some stuff. Um, it, some of the stuff that he pulled up of me talking, it was like, there's nothing... There's nothing that he can pull up that's going to make me feel like a fool. And if it does, it'll be like, whoa, I didn't realize I said that. But that's, a, that's part of the reason why GMS never, um, never has never done this before. Because the attacks they make don't don't really make any sense. Some of the stuff that he was pulled up that I was saying was so on point and in the in the face. It was like one of them was where I go, if you can understand the words that are coming out of my mouth, and it's like, dude, that's a cut on you. You can't understand what I'm saying. You're at, you're down here at this level, and I'm up here. A wrathful man stirreth up strife, but he that is slow to anger appease a strife. I'm not looking to cause trouble. I'm just looking to point things out to them in a, in a nice way. I'm not, I, I would never pull up anyone's video and put it on my page and talk bad about them. I'll tell you about videos. If you want to go check it out yourself, that's up to you, but I don't want to be, um, Bringing other people that I don't even like onto my page. This page is, is sacred. This this page is holy. You don't see me putting up any cartoon characters. I have no graven images. So anyway, let me pray. Heavenly Father, <laughs> I'm glad you have a great sense of humor. And you are not a petty God. You are a, um, a merciful, loving um broad-minded, open-hearted, loving God. You're, you are a, the power that created all this stuff through your son, Yehoshai. Um, we pray that um, the silliness of these times 
will pass over us like like so many um, weak waters that we'll, we'll, we'll pass through these waters without harm and through the fire without being burned. You are our protection. You are our grace. We honor you. Hat on or hat off. Know that we love you and we, especially me, I respect you and love you and would do nothing to dishonor you. Amen. Do I come off like I, like I dishonor the Lord? The hat thing, that's some funny shit. <clears throat> he doesn't get it. He doesn't get it. And you can go into the um, commentaries on it. It talks about this whole Pharisaic or the Pharisees, these men like GMS that um, that are, are too wrapped up in, in the, the verbiage and they don't get the spirit. Spiritual things are spiritually discerned and carnal things are carnally discerned. Oh, what got him mad is when I said, boy, carnal, aren't we? Because he doesn't understand it's a spiritual, it's a spiritual thing that Paul's talking about. It's not a, that was, that was so about those times. It's not about now. That was that was a hit that that's that's a historical ordinance that has lost its all its punch. And they're they're riding on that. Pretty sad stuff, people. These guys are out here trying to teach and they don't even know what they're teaching. So we're gonna go to Romans. Um, 14, four, if you want to follow along, I'm not, you know, they the, the one thing about GMS that's starting to trip me out too, is they, um, they always talk about the same thing. The white man's the devil. Um, this world is coming to an end. Yeah, we know, we know there's evil men out there. We know that they probably came out of the, um, Right where they're having that war right now, the, the Khazarians that came out of the Caucasus Mountains. But we also have these um, these Edomites that are in these Arabs, these these mixed Arab Japhite fuckers. You know, I it doesn't really matter who who they are we know Edom's going to be destroyed but you can't be going around pointing your fingers going he's an Edomite he's an Edomite well you don't know you don't know who's an Edomite we know Bill Gates is probably an Edomite or a, he we know he's wicked you don't need to call him Edomite you don't need to call him Esau just call him the wicked call it call it for what it is don't your broad your broad brush is being pretty lame that's a, that's the sign of a small mind. Broad brushes are the sign of a small mind. Fisher turned hunter. Christian liberty. Oh, so there it is. What we're talking about, what, what, what I've been trying to bring out. <laughs> Salakia, I'm going to have some coffee. I <laughs> got This is some funny stuff because that's the point that GMS and, and IUIC and, and Sakari, they're 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 cartoon characters. They're wearing these stupid garments, and it never says put on elaborate purple, pink, and blue garments and stand on the street corner. The Bible doesn't say that anywhere. It says go into the highways and hedges, wearing sackcloth. Sackcloth is like a fucking burlap, you dummies. They're already thinking they're in the kingdom. They're not. They're not even there yet. Christian liberty. What's Christian liberty? You know, I, I listen to a, um, one of the channels that I listen to. The guy that I I respect, even though there's some strange things there too, is uh, Matthias Ben seventy seventy, and his channel is called Rod of Iron, and his whole doctrine is on Christian liberty. 
the law of liberty. The law of liberty means Yahweh died on the cross for us and we are not under the law anymore. We don't have to worry about what's on our head. Um, the only laws we need to do is, is the ones that are natural. Is it natural for a man to lay with a woman? No, it's not. Or with another man? No. Is it natural for a woman to lay with, lay with a woman? No. Is it natural to have to put um, marks on your body? That's a simple one. How many of these? How many of these GMS guys have tattoos? Besides the fact that um, Apostle Ricard, he has his head covered in every video, but it's okay for him, but not me. Hypocrites, just like I said in the other video, hypocrites. They they have no ability to actually love people because they're so full of hate. So Christian liberty. Let's see what it says. What I just pulled up a couple of scriptures that had to do with um, this Christian liberty. I didn't really read into it. I just wrote them down, and um, I guess this is the only one I really wrote down. I wrote down his Proverbs fifteen, fucking grievous, can't take reproof. Dude, you're the ones that can't take reproof. I tell him, <clears throat> no, I'm not going to go into that. Sorry, Salakia. Um, Christian Liberty, here we are. Romans 14, 1. Him that is weak in the faith receive ye, but not in doubt, but disputations. But not in doubtful disputations. Ooh. Him that is weak in the faith receive him, but not to doubtful disputations. What's a disputation? A dispute. Why are we having disputes over... A fucking ball cap. For one believeth that he may eat all things, another who is weak eateth herbs. Let not him that eateth despise him that eateth not, and let not him which eateth not judge him that eateth. For Yahweh power has received him. Who, the, the guy who talks on his videos with a hat on, talks with a hat on. The one who talks without a hat on and believes that he doesn't want to do it, let him t do it that way. You just can't wear a, a fucking woman's bonnet or um, a wig. Verse 4 of Romans. The letter to the Romans. Same dude, Paul, writing to the Romans. Who art thou that judgest another man's servant? To his own master he stand or falleth. Yea, he shall be holding up, for Yahweh power is able to make him stand. Do you think I'm worried about these guys? About how they're going to affect me? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, dude. Whatever you say is going to happen to me. Grievous hell is coming my way for, for prophesying with a hat. I am scared to death, buddy. I'm about, I'm about shaking in my shoes right now. I don't fear no man. I fear God, but... Even if I get up there and he goes, I would have preferred you not have the hat on. I would have said, you know what? I kind of got that feeling that you might not want me to have the hat on. And, I, and, I've, and I'm listening. And um, I just was trying to make a point about how you love, how you love me so much. The hat doesn't matter. That's all I was trying to say, Lord. He goes, I know your heart. It's not this outward appearance. Hat, no hat. It's not what I wear, it's what I say. It's the words that are coming out of my mouth. What else we got here in Law of Liberty? One man esteemeth one day above another. Another esteemeth every day alike. Like every man be fully persuaded in his own mind.
instead of throwing scripture at me in a in a wicked, uh, angry way, brother, in Proverbs fifteen ten or whatever um, Corinthians. What is eleven four? If you cover your head, you dishonor. If you cover your head, you're dishonoring your head. You're dishonoring the Lord. Um, check it out. Thanks. You know, where's the love? Where's the correct? Where that's not correction when you're. Um, when you're doing it that way, um, let every man be persuaded in his own mind. It's between me and the Lord. Just like a lot of the things that you will struggle with will be things between you and the Lord. It'll be like, damn. Some of you out there do wicked things. We all have our we all have our downfalls. But if you're worried about someone wearing a hat while they're while they're giving message about the Lord, you're so far off the mark. You should be more worried about that poor person that um has turned aside to homosexuality or turned aside to um, thievery or turned aside to Satan worship or turned aside to lying, cheating. These are the things that are the most important to the Lord. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm going to point these things out in a way that may seem like I'm, I'm wishy-washy. Hat on, hat off, hat on, hat off. The point I'm trying to make is this is who I am. This is who I am. And when I cover my head, I feel like I'm, I'm already covered. The, the hat is just a hat. <laughs> the hat is just a hat and a how's that saying go and a turd is just a turd and a word is just the word whatever um let's see he that regardeth the day regardeth it unto the lord and he that regardeth not the day to the lord he does not regard it there you go found it see how the lord leads me to these things i don't regard the hat as anything it's a fucking hat, you numbskulls. But those graven images that you put up of flying super, super niggas. I, I never see any super white guys. What? There's no, there's no white guys in the kingdom, huh? There's no one, no one that looks like me is going to be at the one forty four thousand, right? Uh uh, only niggas. Sorry, slock you. It's, it's, I don't know how to, I don't know what to say. Um, let's, let's go on. Let me see how much time I got. All right. I'm done. Every day is regardeth to him who regardeth. I'll finish. And then I'm, I'm going to do another message. One that's not about this stupid stuff. Um, he that eateth, eateth to the Lord, and he that gives God thanks, and he that eateth not to the Lord, he eateth not, and giveth God thanks. For none of us lives to himself, and no man dieth to himself. For whether we live, we live unto the Lord, and whether we die, we die unto the Lord. Whether we live, therefore, or die, we are the Lord's. Get it, GMS? I'll be back with another message. Thanks for being here. Um, J.D. Nigel, Word of Truth. I love you, Israel. I love you, believers. Love the Lord with all your heart, all your mind, all your spirit, and you will be fine. I'm out.